welcome to the Valley of Winds Trail in the Katadjura. Uh, behind me isn't Uluru, it's a bunch of other large rocks that sit around this general area. So I'll talk a little bit about the history of this region. So if you had any doubt that Australia is an old country, then this should put it to rest. Because this formation and Uluru are products of uh, erosion that happened hundreds of millions of years ago. So around about 300 million years ago, off to the west just that way some more, there used to be a rather large mountain range. But through many thousands and millions of years of erosion, that mountain range has been worn completely away. They used to think it could have been larger than the uh, Himalayas. So what is this place and Uluru? So when this big old mountain range was eroding, there was a bunch of sediments which were eroded off and made big uh, fluvial fans, so fans of sediment deposited that was running out of this mountain range. And over the many thousands of years, the sediment built up and up and up and made gigantic layers. Then, fast forward a few hundred million years, the mountain range disappears, this place gets pretty much submerged underneath an inland ocean, and then the inland ocean retreats, and there is some tectonic action that goes on. And this tectonic action lifts up Uluru by bending it up. That's why there's some kind of striations on a diagonal. The sedimentary layers have been upheaved. Uh, this place was also jettisoned up out of the ground and is being eroded away. So these places, Katajura and Uluru, are just big sedimentary deposits that over millions of years have been eroded away and raised up and forged into these beautiful structures.